Mr. Speaker, as we witness the tragic escalation of violence in Israel, Gaza, and now Lebanon, Canada has abandoned decades of world leadership to sitting on the sidelines. Now with thousands of airstrikes on Lebanese civilians, hundreds killed, including two Canadians and thousands wounded, what will it take for Canada to find the courage to stand up to Netanyahu? Parliament has called for a ceasefire to stop, stop sending arms to the region and to help all those displaced with assistance. When will the Liberals take action to save lives instead of spewing empty words? The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary to the Minister of uh, Foreign, Foreign Affairs. Affairs. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I, I want to thank the member for his question, and he gives us an opportunity to recognize two Canadians who were innocent, who were killed, um, trying to flee from violence in Lebanon. I particularly name Hussein and, and Dad Tabaja. It's, uh, it's a tragedy which is uh, ongoing uh, in the whole Middle East, and Canada has continually called for a ceasefire between Hezbollah and Israel, between Israel and Hamas. We will continue to do everything diplomatically possible to work with allies, to work with like-minded countries, and to express Canadians' concern about this tragedy which is ongoing. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.